So I've been racking my brain trying to figure out what I'm going to play for the next series. I could play a racing game, but the entire point of me trying to think of another game is I don't want to play racing games. I need a break from them. I thought about playing Outer Wilds, but looking at the runtime, I don't want it to take that long uh, or, or for a series. I might still do it off on a one-off video, but also it's the kind of game I kind of want to enjoy on my own and not have to worry about recording it. And then there's plenty of like more cartoony platformers on PS1 that I thought like, hey, I would love to play this, but I'm already doing Ape Escape, so there's kind of some overlap there. I don't want two of like really similar games so i just haven't really been able to think of anything to play and I, i'm still like i i have no idea what i i mean i could but you're just you're just a meme game i don't really want to play a meme game i want to play a game that i actually enjoy Nintendo. i mean yeah you're right i did enjoy you as a kid minus the first like peeves part that i can never get past when i was younger but i just I don't think you're going to hold up to nostalgia. Wingardium Leviosa! I mean, alright, that was a little rude. You don't have to resort to name calling. There's nothing personal. Incendio! Ugh. You know what? Fine. So yeah, I'm playing Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, or Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. If, uh, you know, you're not in the US, that was also just a absolutely stupid fucking intro. I, I do also have the music turned off because I don't remember if this is one of those games that just uses the music that's in the movie. And because uh, I don't remember if this came out. This is 2001. I don't I think this was before the movie, but I don't remember. Uh, but yeah, I just don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk getting a DMCA claim because I played fucking Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. So I just <laughs> turned off the music. There was nothing but about yes. the starry sky that night to suggest that strange and mysterious things would It is kind of weird night. without the music. <laughs> this does have subtitles, slept. though. A huge At least for giant this cutscene, so I can kind of talk over it, and darkness. you can just read. The giant named Hagrid left a blanket wrapped bundle on the doorstep. <clears> I mean, this is just... Drive. You've seen this Nestled if you've bundle, read the book or saw the movie. Like, you, you know how this works. You know the backstory to Harry Potter. It's not that for the next it years, didn't change Harry for the game. Dreadful step parents, the Dursleys, until that fateful day when he received oh, the my letter God. inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Hagrid oh, but doesn't this? Oh, yeah, this just blows over the whole like them trying supplies. to keep him from going to Hogwarts thing. It's just like he got a letter Soon and after, then he was off. <laughs> Harry caught the Hogwarts Express from platform nine and three quarters and left the Muggle world far behind. Hell yeah. Harry sat beneath a sorting hat, hoping that he would not be chosen for Slytherin House over Gryffindor. Not Slytherin, yep. eh? Said the hat in his ear. You could be mm -hmm. correct. Mm -hmm. It's all here in your head, and Slytherin will help you on your way to Alright, get on with it. I already know no. the story. Well, if you're sure, I could just skip it, but I don't want to. Yay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, in, in all seriousness, I did enjoy this game when I was a kid. When I was a kid. Like I mentioned in the uh, intro, I could never... There's like the... F I think it's the first or... Maybe even the second, like, Peeves part, I could just never get through. Oh, doesn't the random kid just come running through here at some point? There's, like, in all of the things, there's just kids running around, and every once in a while, yeah, you just have the kid just running down the stairs past. Like, get out of the shot, idiot. No, Hogwarts is full of secrets, Harry. This is Harry and Dumbledore's moment. Get Just go away. Not all secrets are rewarding. Oh, speaking of oh, secrets, I do have a... Uh, which apparently there's think? like a slightly different ending uh, if you ha get all the cards, so I have a list of the cards at the very least. Painful death. Uh, I, I think this is in order of when I get them. So the first one's not until the beans come in. Oh my god. Nitwit, I, lubber, oddment, tweak, Four wonderful words, don't you think? Oh, I talked to him because I was wiggling the right stick. Because, of course, this is a, uh... <sighs> this is a PS1 game, so it doesn't have analog controls. Can I just go to Slytherin? 
Ah, oh, it's locked. It is very weird without the music. I might actually turn on the music. Is there any music normally here? I don't, actually there might not be music here normally. No, it's always just quiet. So it, music doesn't matter. Music's only during the cutscenes. but I, again, I'll just keep that off just, just in case. Cause I don't remember if that stuff's copyrighted. How do I jump? That's not jump. That's still not jump. Oh, there is no jump. It Why does do uh, Legend of Zelda jumping where it's like you get to the edge of a thing and it just I'm jumps automatically. Hello there, Harry. We have a proposal Sup. for you. In Hogwarts, there yeah. are special portraits. And behind these special portraits are prizes. <laughs> Sweet. But of course, not just anyone can open up the portraits. You need to know the password. If you bring us yeah. earwax, every flavor beans, we'll tell you the This password. is the first card. We'll I can get a card room, for that. Which is through the portrait of the fat lady. See you around, Harry. Bye. Just all the wires are just in my way. I keep hitting the right stick to try to move. Um, where am I going? Do I need to go into the common room? Uh, it's definitely not this way. Nope, that's <gasps> wrong. Oh, I thought I hurt myself. So I think there is fall damage in this game, but maybe it's ridiculous the amount of fall damage. Ch Charms corridor. Is this where I need to go? I don't know. All right. I don't know what the fuck that sound was. I think charms is actually the way I need to go. So let's go into here. Awesome. I hear it. Any stamina? Grab a chocolate. Shut up. I know how the frogs work. They're just health. Save. I didn't do anything. I don't know why I'm saving. Is it still going to be 0%? Oh, how did I make it 6% of the way through the game? Nothing Gringotts happened. Latest. I don't give a Get shit. This is just flavor text. I don't need that. Ah, there's the cards and then nothing else. Wow, really glad I came in here. Super, super, super fun. Oh, it does let off smoke when I try to use a spell. Uh, so is this hey, where it's... Harry, remember me? Ron Weasley. Not even a bit. A slimy slithering Draco Malfoy ran through this door with an owl under his arm. I think it was oh, no. Hedwig. Let's How did he get Hedwig? Him. Like, it's just like, hey, he has your owl. How? How did he, like? Come on, Harry. You're not explaining Hedwig. anything. It's just well, like. Well, well, If it isn't the famous how oh I'm God, Draco shut Malfoy. Up. And you do well to show me respect. Looking no. for that owl of yours. How uh, yeah, yeah, no you shit. Leave it lying about. Go home to your mother, Didn't Potter. Leave... Oh, was it in a sorry. cage? That makes you more sense. I was gonna say, if it was just flying you? around, how the fuck did he get it? We didn't even take the flying lesson yet. He can't fly yet. He's a nasty piece of work. Just ignore us Griffin boys okay. stick together. Alright. I know how to climb. You're gonna explain to me how to climb. I already jumped Come off on, stairs. Harry, I know how it works. To climb up. Just push forwards on your controller. Done. Let's go. Done. Shut up. <laughs> the, the one thing that sucks about tutorials is when you already know the game. <laughs> and then it's like, I don't I don't need this tutorial. Jump, I don't want this. The edge and keep pressing yes, I know. I know how I Oh The triggers of the camera. Can I reverse that? Look mode. Reverse. Did that reverse or am I an idiot? Was normal the correct one for what I wanted? Because that feels worse. It didn't change shit! Nothing happened! What? Look mode's the same! That setting did nothing! What do you mean? Look, there's another feather. I'll double back and watch the entrance. You. Mm. Mm. Right, I'm glad we watched him just jump away. But, like, the I changed that setting and the look mode did not change. So what does that do? The reverse for the look mode. Oh, look mode is... There's, like, the uh, first person look mode, isn't there, eventually? Hello, Harry Potter. My name is Nearly Headless Nick and I am the Gryffindor House Ghost. Look how tall this room is. Why are you so loud? go all the way to the top to get out. Why are the ghosts so... It's like they had the normal voice, 
then Person's added the echo on top, the but didn't balance the two to like make it lower. So it's just two voice clips over top of each other and makes it like so much louder. <laughs> Cause it has that weird echo, but I, I feel like that's exactly what they did. They're just like, oh, we'll just play a normal voice clip and then play another voice clip on top of it. Not realizing that just makes it doubly as loud. <laughs> cool. We just got basic platforming so far. Nothing's happened. There's also, why is there just, platforms up there when I there's nothing to do up there. There's just like those extra two platforms. Also, I mean Ah, some I guess of a <sighs> care of magical creatures class. Careful, they're dreadfully poisonous. Yep. Press the cross button to cast the Fipendo knockback. What's that? From your what am I casting? I'm deaf from your yelling. And watch out for those poisonous snail trails. Cool. Sweet. Thanks for that. All oh, right, I can charge up. Oh, right. I I also remember. So I had a Game Shark on PS One when I was younger, and oh my god, the camera's so awful. And I remember having a Game Shark code you can to L two and R two buttons to rotate. Cool. I I remember having a Game Shark code for. Uh, 999 house points. Cause like, you see the, the score just keeps going up. I kill them. It's like, oh, you get five more, five points to Gryffindor. Uh, I had a cheat code that basically gave you 999 points. And it shows completely how useless the point system Press is in this game. Button to, you can also cool. See what you can uh, it shows how useless the look is because when you are or Hello not the look the the house points are yes things, things can be okay cool i can skip this it's just tutorial like there's no story you're not missing anything if for some reason you don't know the story well i guess you might not know the story of this game even if you know the because there's some things different from the movie at least uh i don't know if there's anything that's like completely different from the book but anyway, it showed how completely useless the house points are. What do you mean? I hit the X button. Okay. I just, how did that just make him small? Whatever. But anyway, to finish the statement that I've been going for for a while, but when you have uh, 999 house points, Slytherin just slow, well, all of them, just have around that amount so it, it's basically designed to be like in the movie where it's like oh you know Gryffindor finished this many points behind and then got all these bonus points at the end uh it's basically I guess designed so that you always have that gap so if you get 20 points Slytherin will get 25 but if you get 999 points they'll have 1004 points because it's like they always need uh, to be five points ahead or whatever. So it makes, when it's counting up the house points, cause like every once in a while it just decides like, hey, we're let's see what the house point count is. And every single time it would take like a fucking hour because it's an hourglass and it's not expecting you to have a ton of points. So it's just like, well, let's uh, go through all the points. Here's Gryffindor. Go, it just takes a while to go through all 999 points, through, just like tick them down, and then it would go to Slytherin, and it would be right around the same amount. And it's like, oh my god, I regret putting in this game shark code <laughs> every single time. I'm never long bottom. Malfoy led me down here and then ran through a secret passage with an owl. Now cool. I'm trapped by these enchanted books. I've cool. What's wrong so with your face? I mean, I say what is wrong with your face. What's wrong with the faces in all of these? <laughs> I mean, I guess they're... See, it's always one of those when I look at something like this and they think, like, how fucking awful the graphics are, but then I'm like, well, this was in 2001. Was this good for 2001? And you know what? Maybe. Actually, no, probably not. I don't remember any other game that looked like this in 2001. So... I can't really say yes or no. The lever is around here somewhere. I mean, the graphics in general are fine. Yeah. Specifically, it. the face graphics uh, are those 
good or bad, and I'm I don't really know the answer to that. G get off the fucking desk, idiot. Nintendo. Cool. Hey, Hedwig freed. That's gonna be cut off a little bit, I think. Ah, I might eh, might be blocked by my camera a little bit. I think I'm technically recording that part. I'm doing. I'm in full screen right now, just because. I already had it set up for Amazing Island because Amazing Island just could not, did not want to handle me not being in full screen, even though it was a 4-3 game that just kept deciding to be widescreen sometimes. I see you rescued Hedwig. Yeah. She was eager to get out, so I yeah. opened the door for her. That yeah. That'll teach Malfoy okay. to miss with us. Hi, so, I'm Neville. But if, I'm in the window too. Harry helped me escape from some flapping book. Nice to meet you, Neville. Come on down. Uh, it's all right. You guys go ahead. I think I've lost my toad, Trevor. Come on, Harry. Cool. Let's go. But, um... What the fuck was I saying? Oh, yeah. RetroArch right now is in full screen, and I just didn't feel like turning it off. So, those achievement pop-ups are more left than they usually are. Maybe I'll just put my camera at the bottom left. So that you see the achievement pop- It doesn't matter. It's just retro achievements. It's not actual achievements. Wow. It's, it's like, and apparently six of the achievements the just is. don't load. Flying, flying lesson. I haven't even gotten the beans yet. I haven't even seen the yellow beans. There's apparently one at the uh, flying lesson. Uh, Here's the doorway to the flying lesson. I'm still waiting for my broomstick. Our stupid out. I didn't want to go. You haven't let me collect the beans yet. There were beans at the end of the hallway. Apparently there's a thing at the flying lesson a uh, card Madam Hooch, your teacher. but um there is a house point shut to up at any of the following tasks stay your shut stick up using the directional buttons and press the cross button to move forward cool first fly through each hoop that appears straight up oh there's beans hold on beans beans you're not beans it says fly straight through the hogwarts symbol higher up Concentrate, Potter, and try again. Okay. So I can try as many times as I want, it seems like, but it says Hogwarts symbol. Is it not here? Is this not the flying lesson that has the Merlin card? <laughs> I'm confused. Well done. Five points for Gryffindor. I didn't finish. Test is a little harder. <laughs> she just gave up. She's succeed. like, yeah, good enough. <laughs> Remember, slow down uh, to turn tighter. Yeah, I don't care. I feel like I was saying something earlier, and then I, I got distracted by flying. What was I oh. saying? <laughs> that, that's not what I was saying, Madam Hooch. Why is it over there? That makes no sense. Why would I have to like fly backwards? Well done, Potter. I shall award ten house points for that fine performance. Ready yeah. for a tougher challenge? There are bonus I'm ready for, a for you to just as before, let me fly through each of the magic hoop on my whistle. Just let me go. I've done this enough times that I know what I'm doing now. Oh. That will never get old. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Failed. Well done, Potter. A good score. Five more house points for Gryffindor. Cool. Mastered the basics of broomstick control. Did I? Now run along. Mastered is a strong word there. I, uh, I definitely flew a broomstick. Hi, Harry. Have you met Hermione yet? She's a real know-it-all and a teacher's pet. No, I am not. Hello, Harry. Charms class is about to start. Isn't it exciting? She's so maybe annoying, it's different she? on the PC version. But the the only guide on game FAQs that has like just card guide and not like a full guide that has it's it's so different. It's so different. Hold on. I, I really I need I need to fucking figure out what the fuck I'm doing here. Collectibles. I don't care about the beans. I just need to know the cards. What? Collectibles, cards. This guy just has a list of cards. I don't need a list of cards. I need to know where they are. What What do you mean? Okay. I haven't hit any that are like, you cannot get these kind of things. I still have, I did miss a card. But I can get it. 
I can go back and get it. Although this just says where they are. It just doesn't, it doesn't actually say how I get them. So maybe not. Ah! Hold on. Drop my controller. We're good. Get up on the bookshelf. Oh my God, look how much I can climb. Look how much I can climb. Why is the bookshelf clipped through the wall? Oh no, I forgot in my spell book. I'll catch you up. All right. Cool. Oh, this is where we get to the point where it's like, hey, you have to race to the the thing, which really doesn't matter. There is a get retro the achievement for it. Before the timer runs out. Walk through the floating clocks to start. Shut the up. There is a retro achievement for getting like a certain amount of points. I guess I think it's like how many points like at bare minimum how many points they got in the movie I think is what the achievement is like set up for but really it doesn't matter I can beat the game I can like, like I it, it, again like I said it doesn't matter I could completely fail this race thing and just get there so late and I'll still have everything I, I'll still be able to beat the game it's not like I get a bad ending or something yeah. You must Done. be Harry Potter. Welcome to Charms class. You're just in time. I am not Welcome just in time. I am early. I, I had Flitwick time left over. Oh, I also didn't get spells. points. You only lose Guardian points for Leviosa. getting late. Watch my one move and <sighs> the cool. Give points to complete each sequence three times to learn the spell. Win Guardian Leviosa. Now you try. Remember, press the symbol button that my one points to. Get ready. I don't know how Simon says helps. Keep trying. I don't know how this helps Excellent. you learn a spell. Perfect. That's not even the shape of Wingardium Leviosa, so just doing a circle. Now it's That's not how that works. That was or good. this. None of this Excellent. makes sense. Well done. You've mastered Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> that, that's it. Follow me to that's see it. Wingardium that's all I needed to... Spell. Achievement unlocked. <laughs> Leviosa, that's all I needed to do. All I needed. Now, just play Simon carefully. Says a couple times and you, you can now just do this a spell. Object can be levitated. Keep the cross button Man, depressed. if you only like actual learning was that easy, you just like play Simon a little bit and just try levitating the hourglass onto its pedestal to open the door but you just did it press the triangle button to release the object but you just did it for me why do I wait you undid it how did you undo it so fast what are you doing you're just that's not the hourglass Ron you're doing nothing you're not being useful in the slightest done I actually didn't even have to hit triangle. You told me that for no reason. Cool. Five points. All right. See ya. I'm going to run out this door. Is that even the door to the actual? Oh, yeah. It does just lead out of the class. I thought we came in the... Wait, didn't we come in the other Here, side? Harry, I'm confused. Please meet me in the castle grounds. You can get to the castle grounds through the front door of the castle. Pop around for a right. cup of tea and, and for some reason, the front door of the castle is locked in the exact you. same way. Your it's like, hey, these things are just not set up, so no one can get out of the castle. Oh, wait. I can still go to the flying practice area? Why can I go to the flying practice area? That doesn't really make sense. Not that it matters, because... Ah, hello again, Potter. I have a special task for you. Some of Hagrid's pet flitterby moths escaped into the courtyard. If you're quick, you can catch them all. Okay. Ready, Potter? I don't oh. think I ever did this. All right. It's going to be tight. It's going to be close. <sighs> I think I might get it. I might get it. Uh, does this just points? Well does this done, just Mr. house Potter. points? You have collected them all. Hagrid will be pleased. For such a service to the school, I shall award 10 oh, points yeah. to Gryffindor. Oh, yeah. Just 10 points to Gryffindor. <laughs> like, yeah. Thanks. Cool. You couldn't give me anything useful. It's just like... Like, you couldn't even give me, like, a, a speed upgrade for the broomstick. Oh, now it's locked. Just like, thanks for catching the moss. Get the fuck out. <laughs> Locks the door behind me. Good. I'm glad. So, I, I, judging by this thing, I remember there being secret passages. I mean, I know there's secret passages because it literally says there's secret passages, but I don't remember how to open them. Oh, well, this one's probably opened by this.
No, that's just house points. Oh yeah, so if I can't climb over it. Oh, I hit square, and then I just push through it. Got it. Got it, I'm forgetting what the buttons do. Hey, hi, Merlin. I think that was Merlin. Good, we got one, finally. Merlin. Yeah, sure, I'll see it. What? I don't fucking care. I didn't realize it was gonna have to go to the loading screen. I regret this decision. Merlin, medieval, dates unknown, most famous wizard of all time. Cool. That, that was really worth the two loading screens that it took to go into it and then back. I'm glad I didn't just hit no. I also have only found, what, 23 of the yellow? Where are the rest of the yellow beans? I just, I'm... I'm hoping I see them when I leave the the castle. I didn't want to climb up on you. I, I ran to it and hit square. I don't know why, because there was nothing, there was no indication that that was going to be a thing. All right. Oh, you are. I see the ground was discolored. Oh, has that always been a thing? And I just never noticed that all of the times I played this game. The ground's like discolored in front of the bookshelf too. Salazar Slytherin. Salazar Slytherin. No, no. Why is it square? <laughs> I keep hitting X to say no, and then it it just doesn't work. I hear suit of armor slicing. Oh yeah, I absolutely hear just a suit of armor. <laughs> At least I assume it's a suit of armor. Watch out for the suit of armor. I think Shut up. Has been at work. I don't give a I shit about peeves. A suit of armor? You hope. What, what, you hope you never meet a suit of armor? What do you mean? Or just the living suits of armor specifically? Oh, also, Harry. I feel like they don't so move, so they're very- student has charmed all of my chocolate frogs, pumpkins, and cauldrons into the air. Please help me to get them back by using your knockback chunks to bring them down. Cool. Oh, this is not- Great to control. Wait, I'm using my knockback jinx to get them down, but I'm just like exploding them. Like I'm not helping you in the slightest. If anything, I'm just like y you're. Thank you, Harry. <laughs> Here, have my famous witches and wizards card as a reward. Cool, but like, you all you did was lose all of that stuff. Like I didn't help you. Like basically. All, you couldn't get all of your pumpkins and chocolate frogs and stuff because they were flying through the air and apparently you just don't know how to like pull them down but they weren't even flying that high like you could have just stopped them but now they're exploded so they're not flying through the air anymore but you also don't have them so I'm not sure why you're thankful for my help. Where does this go? Entrance hall. I don't want to go there yet. Because I want to first go through all these areas because look at all the yellow beans. Look at all the yellow beans. I need those. I mean, I already have enough, but I want them all. I want all 50. Oh my god! I, I, how? What is that hitbox? Look how far over I was. What do you mean? <laughs> Damn, they're really powerful if them slicing the air around me ca causes me to just die. Oh my god, <laughs> that timing. <laughs> All right, uh, can I just like shoot them? No. Better fucking not. I was climbing up. I saw him getting ready to swing. I was like, it's really... Okay. Go. We're good. We're good. I only got, you know, a little sliced up. That's fine. Fred, George, you here? I got your fucking beans. Where are you? Hello, Harry. There you are. Still haven't managed to collect the yellow earwax every frame. You needed twenty-five. The beans and we'll I have them. I've left something behind the portrait that you might find. Cool. Great. Here they are. 
I have them. Didn't you say you needed 25? I've got 40! What do you mean? What do you mean? I've got them in my pocket! Are you, are you kidding me? Have you got those birds? Yes, I've got them. They're right there. I see them in my inventory. Didn't you- Am I- Am I stupid? Did they not say they needed 20? I could have sworn- Or 25? I could have sworn they said bring us 25 of them. I didn't need all 50. And they're just like, Hey, uh, you didn't get us these beans yet. Like, Right, they're in my fucking pocket. What do you mean? What do you mean? Are they the idiots or am I? Is Harry Potter like just like, oh, I like he doesn't have object permanence. He put them in his pocket and he's like, oh, well, wait, well, did I have? We meet again. Having a tour of the castle, are we? This is as far as you'll be going. I'm just, you won't get what do you mean me. a tour? I'm you just trying to fucking to leave. Try. Trapped in a big scary castle, eh? Oh dear. I think Potter is going to cry. What is wrong with you? Damn, I can't just hit him. I can't just shoot him. Levitate. You know what? Let's go through these things first. Because I want to see. Oh, that's a great hall. That was there. I was there. No, that's a loading screen. I don't want that. I want to go through the other ones and see if... Uh... Oh, this is... No, this is great hall. This isn't where I was. Uh, It was grand hall? Great foyer. Okay, I looked over and saw where the... Guides, why is it so laggy suddenly? <laughs> the game can't handle the rendering of all the candles. The emulator, the emulator's just choking. All right, I have now 48 of the 50 beans. Are you, you, you satisfied yet? Can I get the code to whatever painting? Please, because I think it's to this painting. Well now, it's nice to see a new Shut up. I can't remember the last time I However, Shut up. If you can find out, off you go then. But be Fred and George won't tell me the password. They said 25 and they won't take 25. They up the price to 50 beans. I don't have 50. I have 48. I just want some goddamn password. I was going to say I want some beans. I don't want the beans. I want to give them the beans. I don't need the beans. The beans are useless to me. Oh, there's more than 50. I needed 50 for the password. I could have sworn they said 25, and I thought that was a, a measurement of, like, there are f 50 beans total. Oh. Mr. Potter, Jesus your Christ. does not grant you snooping rights. A sloth brain has I was not my <laughs> That was like, <laughs> again, I, I've mentioned this before. Horror games, I don't get jump scared but turning around the corner Snape just fucking standing there when I'm not expecting it was like a little bit of a jump scare <laughs> I was not expecting that also I got the achievement for yellow bean collector which I think is to get all of the beans not just the 50 that are needed I I could have sworn they said 25 but I am just an idiot apparently I also, I also don't have my thing up so I don't know how long I've been recording I actually I'm gonna leave the- I didn't realize I've been recording for 45 minutes. I, I'm actually having fun with this game, so I was just- I- because I have the guide up full screen, I didn't sure see the timing on beans. any of my things. Cool. Fizzy pop. Nice. These are the worst passwords ever. But, um, yeah, so I'll open that. I'll open the door and leave the castle, and then I'll- save and quit like i genuinely didn't know how well this game would hold up work as a series it is still genuinely fun like obviously the graphics are easy to make fun of like all the memes of seeing like haggard especially where his head's like halfway into his body which i i, I guarantee why am i doing this i need to go to the p p p portrait i guarantee like that is not good like i feel like most of I feel like games even in the PS1 era had better graphics, better like person shapes. As much fun as it is to make fun of the graphics, it is a genuinely like fun little like movie slash book tie-in. I, I want to say movie, but I again, I think this was based off the book. Like I feel like this came out before the movie. Nimbus 2000? Hell yeah. Now I can go back to the flying class and collect more stupid fucking moths.
for no reason. <laughs> I love how I went in. It's like, hey, you can collect these moths. If, if Hagrid doesn't say anything and he's not like, oh, hey, you collected these moths for me, right? Thanks. Then uh, it literally that means it was just for those f ten points, whatever I got, and a hundred percent not worth it. All right. I don't know why oh, unlocking the door lesson, caused it to Let just like explode. Wizard crackers. Wizard crackers. I'm not this castle until I have revenge. I don't know how to lock on. I don't know how to lock on. Is that it? Is it is it left bumper? Am I locking on? I feel like I'm locking on. Got him. Oh, this is a super easy battle. I forgot how easy this is. Oh, right. Now Crab and Goyle join. Super wizard crackers. Why haven't you been using them the entire time? Like, once I hit you once, you're just like, I'm going to use the stronger ones. All right. All right. Oh, it's just Crab, not Goyle yet. Or was that Goyle and not Crab? Ow. Yeah, like, why aren't you using those the entire time? I can't pick those up. Like, it can seem stupid that you wouldn't have been using those. Come on, give me some ammo. Damn it. Oh my god, stop sidestepping, you little... Little... Bitch. There we go. If I get closer, does it... Make it easier to hit? <sighs> Makes it easier to get hit. No, because it still kind of takes the same arc, so it really doesn't matter how close I am to him. It's just timing. Oh my god. This is one of those boss- this is definitely like an er- I mean, there's plenty of games that still have the same kind of thing, but this is definitely like an early, like, a PS1 boss battle where it's just like... Do the same thing over and over. At least this one changes. He has, like, multiple phases. At least, yeah, at least he has multiple phases for this one. Oh, I don't need to hold left bumper at all. It just is always locked on them. But this is definitely one of those where it's like, hey, we just, we figured out how this boss battle is going to work. Now just do the same thing three times and then maybe it'll change. Maybe they'll have multiple phases, but God, oh my God, just stay fucking still. I already know how this works. Just stay still long enough for me to hit you. Thank you. God. Oh my god. Oh, I already have one. That's why. Oh my god. I had the timing perfect, and then I ran into another one. Let me go. What is that achievement picture? I absolutely have to have my camera at the bottom left because of those achievement pictures. Uh, next episode, I may need to just turn off the full screen, but... That was, like, what the fuck was that picture? <gasps> Glad that happened. Glad we showed that. Oh! House points! So now you'll kind of, if you've never played this game, you'll see what I'm, I was talking about with the uh, house points filling up. Because if you have, so normally the house points, it does that. But imagine that, but instead of 50 or whatever, 63, it's 999 and goes at the same rate. I think the sand also screwed up. Like, the sand, like, goes up, but then it also, like, gets thinner or whatever because, like, the graphics don't know what to do with that much. Like, 105, it's like, it's like, ah, yeah, I know what to do here. But then... Will Slytherin hold it, the house cup for it doesn't like once you get above year. like 300 it's like I wasn't expecting you to like it's physically impossible to get 300 in one go I don't know how this happened so like I can't blame them blame it for looking bad because who the fuck was gonna test that if you physically cannot get a certain amount of points in one section, oh, there's no the reason Hagrid. to make it. Good to see you. These are the Hogwarts Castle grounds, and I'm the gamekeeper, of course. You'll need I to know. attend your herbology. I class. know who you Professor are. Sprouts you took me to Diagon Alley to go I'm shopping. I know who the tea. fuck you I'm are. Why are you talking here. to me, Not talking to me grounds. like we've never met? You sent me a letter saying, "Hey, 
come meet me. Like, you're, t you're telling me, like, now you just don't know who I am and you're just like, I wanted to go save. Oh, did we gotta, no, let me go save. No, I can't save, I gotta do herbology. <laughs> no. Oh, we got the purple beans. What are these? Blueberry, I think, actually. I think that is actually the thing. I, I was gonna make a joke and then I just ended up saying the right answer. We gotta learn the the light light beam one or whatever it is. Is this the light? No, this is, um. I was thinking this was the light because I'm thinking of Lego Harry Potter where you get the uh, Lumos or whatever it's called. Incendio, fire, that's like light. Just a lot cooler light. All right, we gotta play Simon Says to learn how to start a fire because that's how that works. Nice. How many more? One more. Damn it. Excellent. Uh, my finger slipped and I accidentally hit the triangle. Perfect. All right, we're good. Incendio, why is Incendio green? I'm literally starting something on fire. All right, I don't remember how this- Incendio! Oh, I just need to like- Excellent, Harry. Uh, Cool. Five points to Gryffindor. Yeah, thanks. Can I go save now? I wanted to- I did want to do that lesson. Please. Oh, you got more- Is that a Quidditch game? Is that what that is? Or is that just more flying lessons? Alright! Finally saving. Overwrite. Done. What percentage of the way am I through this game? 25% of the way through- I'm glad I chose this as a series. But part of the reason I mentioned, like, Outer Wilds I didn't want to do because I- I- Looked online and it was like 16 hours or something. It was like the estimate 10 hours, 16 hours. I'm like, that's going to be such a long series doing that one video. Like, two, you know, two. Ep what words am I trying to say? An episode every two weeks. That's what I was trying to say. So I was just like, nah, this this one. I, I, I don't really feel like doing that as a full series. But the fact that I am 25% away through this game after one episode. Uh, that's about the a good. uh. That's a good length. That's exactly about how long I wanted the uh, series to be, because that'll only be like, it'll probably slow down, so it'll be like five, six episodes instead of four episodes, but still, like, it's gonna be pretty quick. And then I can just move on to something else, move on to like one of the many other PlayStation 1 games or non-PlayStation 1 games that I want to do as a series. But, anyway, for now, I am just gonna end this episode here. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.